All right, now we're going to want to install Subversion on the Mac. You're going to want to go to the web address below and download the bundle for the ARM 64M1 optimized uh, Smart SVN bundle. And uh, in, in download that. Now we're going to install it with a Smart SVN, uh, the DMG installer. So we'll go to Downloads and we'll click that and drag and click Smart SVN here. Great, so it's installed. And now we're going to want to start it up and enable that. Okay, so now it's going to ask us what we want to do. So we're going to want to check out a, po a project from the repository. And here what we're going to do is you're going to need to get the string uh, from your repository directory and enter it here. We're going to click continue and we're going to click continue here. We want the whole repository. And here we want to put it uh, in a logical spot. We're going to put it in documents and we'll call this one Greece. Okay, so this is for a project in Greece. And we're going to click continue. And we're going to check out a working copy and add a new project, rationally named. We're going to click finish. And now we're going to watch it check out. So it's actually downloading all of the Blender files from the central, uh, central subversion uh, repository. And we can watch it go. It's going to take a little while. Great. So now it's checked out. And we can see now if we look here, we'll see a hierarchical folder structure. Uh, right now we're not actually seeing files in there so we're going to want to go view and we can click unchanged give it a second so now we can see all the different blend files that are downloaded for our scenes in our set and we have a, a file hierarchy that's set up originally by uh, blender studio for use in our animated films and we're using it because it looks it works really well and so the library uh, is contains all the different subfolders including environment scenes and set uh, we'll go over this in more detail later but environment is typically the raw materials for building these scenes. And this is in separate subdirectories. We'll have uh, the assets for a atmospheric house or a river cave in this area. Sets are where you use uh, the assets in the environment directory to assemble a given set. A set might be, in this case, a, an atmospheric house or a river cave. And then scenes is where we link in one or more sets into uh, a given blender file. And that's where we add lighting. And we'll go into that in a little bit later.